After Iran was released from the arms embargo, Tehran is expected to gradually begin presenting Iranian products at international military exhibitions. This happened on March 23, when at the International Exhibition of Naval Defense in Doha, Qatar, Iran presented a scale model of its long-range anti-aircraft missile system AD-200. Earlier in the year, BulgarianMilitary.com reported that Tehran had already tested the capabilities of its new air defense system during a home military exercise, the Madafian Aceman Belay at 99 exercise. Sources said at the time that the AD-200 was perhaps an exported version of the Bavarian 373 air defense system. Iranian experts say their system is similar in operation and functionality to Russia's S-300 or even S-400 air defense systems. At the Dimnex 2022 exhibition in Doha, Qatar, which ended today, the 23rd, Iran presented a scale model of an entire battery of the AD-200 air defense system, sources said. Sayyid-4 Guided Missile The Sayyid-4 Guided Missile looks similar to the Sayyid-3, but it is larger and slightly more conical than its predecessor. It also shows similarities to the Russian Torch 48 and 6 e 2 In order to align its trajectory the Sayyid-4 has thrust vector control TVC, and as a target detection method is either seeker a to ground guidance SAG or track via missile TVM is used. The Sayyid-4 guided missiles can be launched using vertical takeoff systems, which, due to their square shape, are similar to those of the MIM-104 Patriot anti-aircraft missile system. The effective range of the missile should be 200 km and the service ceiling 27 km. More about the Baba 373 missile system. Iran unveiled the Baber 373 missile systems AD-200 is supposed to be the export version of Bavaria 373 on October 22, 2020. BulgarianMilitary.com learned then that during the Madafian Aceman Belay at 99 exercise, the Iranian army has presented and has tested its latest development in the field of anti-aircraft missile systems, the Baber 373. According to Iranian military engineers, the new Iranian system is in operation since last year can be compared in terms of features and functionality with those of the Russian Federation S-300 and S-400. According to the technical data and characteristics provided, the Baber 373 is an air-to-ground missile system with a long range. The system has two missile silos, each loaded with the Iranian Sayyid-4 missile, which flies approximately 27 km height and has a range of about 300 km. According to Iranian experts, the missile system serves not only to intercept aircraft but also to destroy ballistic missiles. From the information provided, it is clear that the entire anti-aircraft missile system is built and propelled by an 8x8 truck, with the missile silos mounted in the rear axle of the vehicle. The Madafian Aceman Belay at 99 is a military exercise taking place in Iran and involves almost all units of the Islamic Republic's air defense forces, as well as parts of the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps IRGC. It is characteristic of the exercise that it is held in half of the country, which makes it a really large-scale and nationwide exercise. Iran also shared launch footage of the Baber 373's Sayyid-4 missiles, which supposedly is capable against targets ranging from jet bombers and fighters, stealth aircraft, drones, and crews and ballistic missiles. Tehran claimed the system remains effective under all weather conditions and is hardened against jamming and nuclear biological chemical threats. Iran's chief military threat comes in the form of air and missile strikes from the United States, Israel and Saudi Arabia. This explains why the deployment of an ostensibly top-tier system is receiving such hype. Back in 2007, Iran first sought to import five batteries of Russian S-300 PMU-1, NATO codename SA-20 Gargoyle, air defense systems, which can engage aircraft up to 93 miles away. But even as Iranian technicians were training to operate the S-300 PMU, in 2010 then-Russian President Dmitry Medvedev elected to block the sale as part of international sanctions imposed in response to Tehran's nuclear research program.
A year later, Iran announced it would instead develop its own S-300 inspired system, called the Baver, Belief 373. Tehran periodically reported the successful tests and progress, and first displayed the new missile batteries to the public in August 2016. Earlier the same year, with the easing sanctions due to the 2015 JCPOA nuclear deal, Russia went ahead and delivered four S-300 PMU-2 batteries, each of which constituted four launch vehicles and two radar vehicles. However Iran continued to develop the Baver 373.